Music can be used as a way to disseminate crucial information to the public. In view of South Sudan's food crisis, the Juba-based music group J Family recorded a song Stakal Shedid encouraging people to engage in agriculture. The group launched a campaign resolving around this song in Juba on Saturday, 16 August. <laughs> Speaking during the launching ceremony, the deputy governor of Central Equatorial State, Manasi Lomole, said the public should learn from their leaders who have farm projects. He also asked the government to allocate more for the agricultural sector. His Excellency Salva Kirmayardit has a marvelous farm here in Juba. We thank the Bari community for availing that land to our leader. Governor Clement Wanikonga has a very huge farm in his home village and is doing extremely very well. South Sudan today, when we put our resources into good use, we can feed a quarter of the human population on a 25% of the human population can be fed by South Sudan alone. My people, what devil has entered us that we are now dependent on our neighbor's house for food? That's a challenge that you young people have to take and take up very, very seriously. Try to uh, change this. Catherine Joan. The National Minister for Lands and Housing, Jacob Lopai, the State Minister for Agriculture and Forestry, and SPLM Acting and Deputy Secretary General Annie To, among other leaders who attended the function, voiced their concerns about the widespread food insecurity across the country and told people to engage in agriculture instead of looking for office jobs. Agriculture should not be considered like the job of people who have failed to get a job in the ministry and they are going back for agriculture. We should have the love for agriculture and we take it as a, pro, as a, a career because agriculture is the main source of our food. And for the first thing you wake up in the morning, you have to eat. When you go back from work, you have to eat. And where, what do you eat? You have to cultivate what you eat. And we ignore agriculture. This is our greatest mistake. Unless we concentrate on agriculture, we will never ever industrialize. J family, you have stuck your hands in the most important area of this nation. Either we get agriculture right or we sink. There is no country that makes it if they're not producing anything. And if they're not exporting anything, no nation can succeed. No country can succeed. Give me an example anywhere. We will not succeed unless we begin producing, not just for our stomachs, but for the factories and for the export. If we don't get to that level, then we will never be democratic because the wars will continue to be struggling for powers because we think through powers we can get easy money and our stomach. We have so many projects ahead of us. They have told you people up to... Lubang Steven, the manager of the artists performing during the launch, appreciated all the people supporting their campaign, but also lobbied for more support in order to make the campaign a success. I would like to thank everybody who is in support of the J family. Uh, since last year, we have been looking for funds how we can reach these places. We write proposals. When they look at this coming from musicians, ah, they are going to do this. Ah, they are like negative perspective towards the music. But today, you, they can prove you wrong that it should be positive because it's agriculture that can make us sit here. I am sure some of you have taken something before they came here. So if, if you know you take something before you come here, why don't you support what is supposed to make you come here? or what is making you to go to the office, or what is making you to drive. Because I'm, 
I think health is the second, but food is first. Even if you are sick, <laughs> you cannot be treated without being given glucose. So to me, the government should concentrate on agriculture first, and then the ministry, the, the health and others will come later on. Following the request for more support, the deputy governor, Manasi Lomole, donated 5,000 South Sudanese pounds for the campaign. Receive this from the bottom of our heart. If my governor was here, he would have done better than me, but I'm only a simple deputy governor. <laughs> The shooting of the documentary and the video of the song. So you need to visit this website, please. If you don't have it, write it somewhere. The Nile, www.thenile.org. Yes, you can even check it out right now. And when you go home, go and let the people around you also watch what you have seen right here. It's very, very inspirational. While the government certainly has to play the biggest role in fighting food insecurity, it remains to be seen if people feel encouraged enough to join the fight by engaging more in agriculture themselves. For the Niles, I am Simon Bingo in Juba.